Hey everybody, hope everybody's having a great day. So today we're gonna read a story called, Germs Are Not For Sherry. So like my other video, I said it's very important to wash your hands and this explains what happens if you don't wash your hands and why it's so important to wash your hands. So it's called, Germs Are Not For Sharing. The front, the front, the front of the book. The back, the back, the back of the book. The spine, the spine, the spine of the book. The title, the title, the title of the book. The author, the author, the author of the book. The illustrator, the illustrator, the illustrator of the book. Hmm, what else? Ooh, the pages, the pages, the pages of the book. The words, the words, the words of the book. So, Germs Are Not For Sharing by Elizabeth Burdick, illustrated by Marieke Hanlon. Germs Are Not For Sharing. But before I start the book, we're going to go over our three words of the day. So, the first word is hand. Hand is the end of a person's arm beyond the wrist, including the palm, fingers, and thumb. For example, this is a hand. This is one hand right here. And my other hand right here. It has a palm. Fingers and a wrist. Hand. Hand. He's doing a lesson on, on the computer right now. Yeah, we'll send that over. The next word is called germs. <gasps> germs is a microorganism that can make you really sick. Germs. So if you don't wash your hands, guys, eh, all those germs are going to come on your hand. And we do not want that to happen because that could get you really sick. So make sure you get the soap, wash your hands, the bottom of your hand, and the top of your hand, and between your fingers. So our next word is called sick. It's called sick. It means when you're feeling nauseous and wanting to vomit or cough, like this. <laughs> I have a stuffy nose. <clears throat> I'm so sick. So we could start our story. Germs are not for sharing. What do you need to do? Say tissue, please. Or go ahead and reach to get a tissue. Blow or wipe and toss it in the garbage and then wash your hands after. Good job. Cough. <coughs> Cough. <coughs> Cough. <laughs> what do you need to do? Do you just cough all over everywhere without covering your mouth? What do you think? Mm, I don't think so, huh? That's right. We must cover our mouth like this. We call it the vampire cough. So you get your arm like this, stick it far out. You don't really have to do that, but it helps. And you go, <coughs> cover your mouth. So you turn your head away and you cough into your sleep, like the story says. <gasps> Why? Why do we need to do all this? <gasps> because germs, germs uh -uh, are not for sharing. <gasps> germs can get you <coughs> sick. Sick. Oops, uh-oh, what a 
did she do? Look, if you look closely, she dropped the cookie on the floor. What do you think she should do? Do you think she needs to put it in the trash? And maybe just get a new one? Put it in the trash, wash your hands, and she can get a new one, huh? It's time to get a new one. Oh, and when you go to the bathroom, flush! What do you need to do? Go wash your hands. Because germs are not for sharing. How do you wash your hands? With warm water, lots of soap, scrub, 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 and sing a little song. La, 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 la. La 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 When do you wash your hands? Before it's time to eat. And when things get messy, when you sneeze, a chew, or cough, or go potty or anything, you need to Wash your hands. <gasps> gurgle, gurgle, gurgle. Send those germs down the drain. Bye bye, germs. <gasps> bye bye. <gasps> smooch, smooch. Kisses are nice and to give and get. However, when you're sick, What can you do? Stand back, blow a kiss like this. And catch the kiss. That's right, like that. I'm gonna blow a kiss to you guys, ready? I miss you all. The end. So let's see. What happened in the beginning of the story? Inventions. Hmm? What you do when you have to sneeze. And let's see what happened in the middle of the story. Hmm. It says about what you do after you go potty. And then at the end of the story, hmm. Ooh, it shows what you could do instead of giving kisses with your lips. You blow. The end. Are we ready to go over our words? One, two, three. How fast can we go? How fast can we go? We'll take turns saying words we know. How fast can we go? Woohoo! My turn. Germs, sick, hand, your turn, nice guys. So that is the end of our story. Hope you guys are having an awesome day. And we'll see you guys again tomorrow uh, with day two. All right. Take care, guys.